Mecca mercenary charging at the, at the bell. Justin Zane just gets out of the way. And a running shoulder block. And another one right in the midsection. Oh, Mecca mercenary comes out with a clothesline but misses. Zane. Justin Zane ducks, goes to the second rope. Oh, and a high cross body from the second rope. One, two. This is a rematch from last week. They had a cage match. It was an escape, escape match, which Justin Zane won. Yep. If I remember correctly, he went right over the top of the cage, Devin Graves. And an elbow by Justin Zane, the Mecca Mercenary. And another elbow. And another elbow. I'm sure Mecca Mercenary. I'm sure Mecca Mercenary is out to get revenge for, for losing last, last weekend. I'm sure he's going to try Devin Graves, but right now it ain't looking too good for Mecca Mercenary. Justin Zane's all over him, like a bad suit. And a splash in the corner. And another splash by Justin Zane on the Mecca Mercenary here at Halloween Hellraiser number nine. And a chop. And another chop. And a punch to the right side. And another chop. Justin Zane all over Mecca Mercenary. He's got him goozled now in the corner. Mecca Mercenary has him good. He's choking him. Oh, and he just throws him across the ring, Devin Graves. Imagine the kind of strength it takes to lift up a man the size of Justin Zane and throw him across the damn ring. Now he's choking him across that second rope, cutting off that all-important air supply. If you can't get air to your lungs, you can't mount no offense. And that's what he's trying to do to Justin Zane now. Kind of like my cape is trying to do to me tonight. Here at Halloween Hellraiser number nine, Devin Graves. Oh, and a swing and a miss. Oh, that didn't miss. Justin Zane lighting up Mecca Mercenary with chops. Oh! But Mecca Mercenary stops him cold with a headbutt from hell. Oh, he's got his head on the top turnbuckle just grinding that forearm into it. Trying to rearrange the facial features of Justin Zane here tonight in Wentworth. Oh! And he splashes him and Justin Zane falls down like a sack of taters. Mecca Mercenary is indeed a sight to behold. He's got to be ever, every bit of 6'3", probably 400 pounds. And I'm just guessing, Devin Graves, you know my worst subject is math. But I'm just guessing, but I tell you what, he's a hell of a big man, and I would not want to be in there with him myself. Right now, he's got Justin Zane right where he wants him in a headlock. Justin Zane trying to mount some kind of offense. And he's putting elbows in the midsection. Oh, and a jawbreaker! And a jawbreaker! Justin Zane hits a jawbreaker! And Mecca Mercenary answers with a clothesline. Two and a half, and Justin Zane kicks out. Mecca Mercenary is truly an evil force to be reckoned with here in HCWA. Mecca Mercenary just absorbing those blows by Justin Zane. And now he's giving forearm shots of his own to the side of the head of Justin Zane. He's got Justin Zane up on his shoulders. Oh, he rams his head into the top turnbuckle. Oh, and he drops him right on his back. What's that called, Devin Graves? Something like that. Mecca Mercenary signaling an elbow. 
Could he be going to the second rope? But it's top rope for an elbow. That's a long ways for a man that size to get up there. But if he gets up there and hits it, he's going to win the match. I tell you that, Devin Graves. Because that's going to be like a truck hitting a damn road post. Oh, and the elbow, and Justin Zane moves out of the way. Mecca Mercenary is hurting now. But he's back up. He's favoring that right arm, though. Oh! Justin Zane firing back with right hands. Justin Zane, a house of fire now here at Hellraiser number nine. Irish ripping to the corner. Oh, he sidesteps. Mecca Mercenary and answers with a kick of his own. Mecca Mercenary rushes him. Just as Zane jumps over the top, he blocks the clothesline, pushes him into the corner. Oh, and a high knee. Just as Zane hits a high knee on the Mecca Mercenary. Mecca Mercenary is down. Oh, and another high knee levels. Levels. Mecca Mercenary. Mecca Mercenary in a bad way now. Just as Zane with the firm grasp on the upper hand now to the delight of these fans here in Wentworth, North Carolina at the Armory. I think Justin Zane's making a mistake now. You should be sticking him. Oh, and a suicide dive over the top rope. And he takes Mecca Mercenary down. Son of a Sasquatch. Man, was that pretty, Devin Graves. He went sailing over the top rope just like Superman. All that was missing was a cape. Mecca Mercenary throws him ribs first into the ring barrier. Mecca Mercenary got him up on his shoulders. What's he gonna do? Oh, he went to ram him into that to the ring post, but instead, just as Zane ran Mecca Mercenary's head into the ring post. He's seeing stars now. Or pumpkins. He's seeing pumpkins tonight. Dancing around his head. And Mecca Mercenary cannot reach the 10 count. And your winner of the match, Justin Zane. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner by Kevin, Justin Zane. Uh-oh. Mecca Mercenary got some plunder. He got some plunder in the ring. Justin Zane better turn around. Turn around, Justin. Turn around. Damn it, no. Oh. He hits him with a chair. Mecca Mercenary hits Justin Zane with a chair to the back. And he's down. Well, that's two weeks in a row, bro, that Zane is beaten. Oh, and another chair shot to the back. It doesn't matter, Devin Graves. This is wrestling. You get, you get beat and you win on a weekly basis. You just got to take your losses as well as you take your wins. And right now, Mecca Mercenary is being a sore loser. Mecca is just releasing some frustration right now. Maybe he needs to find him a Halloween witch and release some frustration on. But not Justin Zane here in HCWA. Mecca Mercenary lays way to Justin Zane. Leaves him laying in the ring. Help! We need help! If you remember last week, Devin Graves, there was questions about the well-being of Justin Zane. He had suspicions that he may have had a concussion last week. And if he did, I never did hear an update. But if he did, 
That right there tonight would have only complicated his situation. Hopefully, Justin Zane is okay. Here comes Chicano Power, Robert, and the Bull, David McBride, Alpha Health. 